Hi, my name is Karen, and today is day nine. Thank you for returning to the 12 Days of Abundant and Vibrant Health for 2013, where I'm providing mindful nutrition and lifestyle strategies. Today we're talking food, and as it relates to weight loss, and possibly if you're trying to change your diet to become more compliant with a health condition. And so, oftentimes our kitchens are too tempting. There's a lot of food that we keep there that we know is a trigger for us, or that we can't just have one. And while this isn't a new concept, many people don't take the time to change or make over their kitchen, and it's often related to family members. Not always, but often. And so today we're going to talk about how to negotiate with your family. So if possible, get it all out. Get all of your tempting food out, because truthfully, no one in your family needs chips, pudding, and all that other processed or packaged food or high fat foods and so it's not going to hurt anyone to remove it but I also understand that these foods can also have some comfort level to them too and so some family members might be resistant to removing them all together so one of the things you can do is negotiate set a time limit preferably 30 days and that would begin January 1st to an end on January 31st to give you the most chance to be successful with the changes that you are trying to make. And hopefully at the end of those 31 days, no one will remember what you negotiated and you won't even have to bring those foods back. But if you do need to bring them back, I recommend this next negotiation of bringing them in in single servings. And so that your family members will look at those chips or junk food or pudding as treats as opposed to staples that are in the house all the time. And truthfully, no one needs pudding or chips or soda on a regular basis. It's not going to hurt to not have them in the house. So I'm hoping that these two tips for negotiation will help you remove the tempting foods from your home. So today, let me know in the comment section what foods are tempting for you and how you avoid them or if you do avoid them at all. I look forward to seeing you on day 10. Thanks, bye.